Here's how to set the print area when you're trying to print something. And you may want to break this up into multiple pages. I know this doesn't look like much, but if you do, this is how you do it. File, download, PDF, and here are our print settings. Now, over on the right, we have the ability to print the current sheet, workbook, selected cells, and check out here, normal, and it says fit to page breaks because I can come here and edit the page breaks. I can click custom page breaks, click edit, and now I can take the cursor and where at the bottom or the right side, I can move it to where I want the pages broken. So if I have like this bar here, maybe I only want to print the first two lines, then the next two lines, then the next two lines, and then the next two lines, and I can move as many breaks here. And same in the columns. I'm going to move actually the columns to the far right. Confirm breaks. And now you can see that each of the two rows are on different pages, but the header is not. To do that, we just go to headers and footers on the bottom. You can also hit cancel and just go click right above the one and bring it under so we can freeze that. Go to file, download, PDF. Let's switch back to fit to page breaks. And now all of our pages have the same header. Isn't that pretty cool, right? And just hit export and that will download a PDF so you can print this with as many page breaks as you want, rows or columns or both. Enjoy. You're watching Better Sheets here on YouTube. Make sure you check out this video or this video and subscribe right now to get more tips, tricks, how to's, get more out of your Google Sheets than you ever have before. I'm excited to be making a ton more videos here. Ask me questions down in the comments and I will answer them in future videos. But for right now, right here, one of these videos is gonna be your next Google Sheet.